is how to make a collage using a drawing as a plan. I'm going to start with an outline of my subject. I want to think uh, coloring book style, so not too much detail, just solid blocks of color. Then I want to take my drawing and get a handful of photocopies made. Uh, that's what I'm going to be using to cut the pieces from. Next, I'm going to take my original and color in each section a different color, just to make sure that all my sections are lined up correctly. Well, this is my plan for a toucan. I've drawn it, I've got photocopies made, and I've colored in each section. I'm going to take this plan um, and use one of my copies to start cutting out the largest shape first. So here's my photocopy, and my largest shape is going to be one of these black pieces. So what I'm not doing is making uh, puzzle pieces. I'm actually going to cut out and layer the pieces on. Notice in my example, I forgot to get photocopies made before I colored it in. I can get photocopies made afterwards, but it's very difficult to see the things on my plan. So I'm thinking about my layers and I've decided to do that black piece first. I'm going to dig through the scrap bin and find a black piece of paper and try to conserve as much paper as possible. So I'm going to position my plan off to the side so that I'm not um, wasting paper. And I'm going to use an X-Acto knife to start cutting out the outline of that one large shape. Here's my black piece. I need to save my photocopied piece so that I can cut out the other colors. So I'm going to set that black piece aside and start to look at which is the next largest shape that I'm going to do. The next shape I want to do is this bright lime greenish yellow colored shape because then I can layer on those tiny green and red pieces and his eyeball. So I'm going to find that color of paper and take that little piece of my plan that I've already cut out a little bit of um, to cut out that next green piece. I still need to save my photocopied pieces because I have some more colors I need to cut out. But now I have a green piece that I can layer on top of my black piece. Here's how I store all of my pieces because I don't want to throw anything away until I know that I'm done with it. So I make a little folder to keep them all in so that I can put them in my storage space. Here I've started to put the pieces together onto my background. I still have a couple things I need to cut out. The branch, the toes, the eyeball, um, the leaves, the stuff like that. Um, and then I'll layer all those on top and end up with my final piece. <laughs> 